What's up, guys? It's Nick. Um, playing some more Day of the Tentacle, trying to get that four billion carat diamond. The number to call is 1 800 Star Wars. Don't miss this amazing <laughs> once in a lifetime opportunity. <laughs> Now, so we got the battery made. Now it's time to go do some other stuff, right? So let's get out of here. Yay, human contest. Let's go upstairs. I just want to get him out of here. You go over here and you sweet. There we go. All right. There we go. Go to Laverne. Oh, there she is all dressed like a squid. Okay, let's go. Oh, uh, wait a minute, let's do this. Let's go to John. To give some stuff to the toilet. Textbook. Flyer. Unwanted sign. Dime. Paint. Fork. We're going to send a fork. And then we're going to send... Fake barf. <laughs> Okay. Now we go back to you. Get the pink barf. Pick up the barf. It's empty. There's nothing to get. What's crazy, so yesterday when I was doing this, my internet said, oh, it's unstable, and today it says excellent. Not like anything's happened. I have DSL for God's sake, and I live like a block away from the, from the hub. So what is that? All right, pick up fork and toilet. Yay, all right. Yeah. I'm going to go to Hoggy. Go to Hoggy. Creeps of people out here. Wow, he has to go all the way outside to do this. Go to the field. I think he'd lose some weight by having to walk this much. No. He doesn't even need anything. A spaghetti. Laverne, pick up the noodles. noodles. All right, now. There she goes. Hey, cat. Just Can't get it. close to him. I want to ask you something. It may trouble you. Ask away, sir. I can take it. I've got a strong stomach, nerves of steel, bowels of brass. Sir, can it, son? This is important. Have any of your friends seemed a bit firm lately? Ooh, ick! You mean like non-squishy and non-slimy? That's right. Come closer. I've recently become suspicious that humans might try to infiltrate us. No! Though basically stupid, they can be tricky. They may be in disguise. It opens automatically. Well, thank you.
Hello, I'm a tentacle. I'd like to enter my insignificant human in the show. Oh my, yes, yes, of course. Take these tags and put them on your human and have them wait on the bench in the lobby. Entrance will be judged in three categories. Best smile, best hair, and best lamb. Thank you, fellow tentacle. Unlike humans, you have been very useful. Oh, uh, thank you. Believe me, it was my pleasure. Now all I need is a human. Yowza! That was one good-looking tentacle. Oh, okay, give me that. Don't go out the door, you weirdo. Jeez. Alright, now. Look at these weirdos. Look at that. So crazy looking. Alright, now we go. Go up there. Oh, look at that. That's right. It's a time capsule. Oh, we've already been up here. <laughs> nice. Right. Hello, my silent gauze wrapped friend. I've got to get power to my chronogen. Maybe I could try to find some batteries. I'm concerned about the human show. Where am I going to find a human to enter? Most of the humans are probably entered already. I really should go now. Call me sometime, okay? Bernard might like it, but it's way too tacky for me. Comfy. No time to relax. I'm trying to save the world. Here we go. That might be how you're going to it. Yeah, take some roller skates too. Ready to go now. It oh He's too heavy to carry. I don't know 
why he keeps doing that. I understand. But I'm hitting the button and get really close to that, but I don't want to go down the stairways. I don't want to go right there. So let's go down. And we're going to ask you. Hey, where did everybody go? Be seeing you. Yes, perhaps I can regale you with tales of my adventures. Eh, no thanks. Now where are they? I couldn't help noticing you ranting. Not ranting, plotting. Okay. So, what are you plotting? I'm building a shrinking ray, which I can use to shrink those pesky humans out of my sight for good. Tell me more about this shrinking ray of yours. I call it the Diminuator. The biggest problem left is to design a trigger that doesn't require fingers. If you'll excuse me, I've got something in the oven. Anyone I know, eh? Ah. What are you babbling about? You really should have told the judges if you weren't feeling well. Oh, ick! Now, how did that mess get in there? I think I'm going to be sick. Someone in here not feeling well? I was feeling fine until I saw that. Is that your regurgitation? No, I'm an healthy human. Didn't you just say you thought you were going to be sick? That's just a figure of speech. Do you realize you could have infected the whole show with human influenza? But I just got all my shots. You're a good-looking human, Harold, but you know the rules. You're out of the show. What a mess. That was brutal. I hate cleaning up after humans. That's probably one of the worst ways to get rid of it. Perfect. I could never do that to someone as shy and sensitive as my friend here. As well, huh? There you go. And so I said to her, that's not my suction cup. <laughs> you think that's funny? Listen to this. Hey, 
When are you guys going to judge best hair? Oh, all right. Wow, that's the best hair I've ever seen on a mummy. Thick and full and juicy. The mummy wins. Agreed. Dun, 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 dun. It's weird that he's got so much that he's got to walk through to do it. All right, uh, upstairs. Now we've got best smile, so, uh, you know, probably best idea to get some fake teeth. That we already used all our fake teeth on George. So there's other one place where you have teeth. That is the horse with his denture cut. Yeah, that's right. We need to talk to the horse. Or read him the horse. Ahem. The LALR compiler is constructed by the following method. First, develop a rigorous elective grammar. If the elements have NP completeness, the crunchy factor can be ignored. Blah, 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 blah. Wow. Dang straight. There we go. All right, there's mummies everywhere, dude. Look at that mummy right there. Let's have a scuffle. Okay. Good. That means we can do something. 
I'll go back to my brain. I'm gonna go win a contest. With horse teeth. Come on, let's go. I'm sorry, but no one gets to this clock while I'm here. And unless I have to go chase down some escaped humans, I'm glued to this spot. Rats. Wonder how that's gonna happen. Escaped humans. Guys, going to judge best smile. Oh, all right. I like the quiet one with the big T. There's nothing in the rules about them being white. First place goes to the mummy. Agreed. Bum, ba, da, bum. So there's a box of laughs. A lot of this game is pretty much just walking back and forth from the time machines. Not 
that button. Double flare. Red paint, coffee, decaf, funnel, Swiss bank, keys, disc bank, hamster. Voxel laughs. <laughs> This ought to be good. I can't believe it's 6.46 already. All right, so now we've got to do something with the mummy. We got to do it. going to judge best left. <laughs> oh, all right. Oh, all right. Okay, who's got a joke? Hey, I just flew in from Baltimore, and boy, are my suction cups tired. <laughs> oh, classic. It's amazing how the mummy can do that without moving his lips. I say we give him first place. Agree. Well, that makes him best of show. Let's go congratulate him. He is very well preserved. I'll miss his laugh. It's time to give him his winnings <laughs> and start packing up. We gotta get this whole show to Baltimore by Thursday. Yes, our work here is done. He's so pretty. Look at him. Well, Ted, this is where we <laughs> part ways. You've certainly helped save humanity. Even though you've been <laughs> dead for thousands of years, I think you're my favorite Edison. that they don't realize that she doesn't make such noises when she moves. Back up there. Up there. 
this. Well, what do we have here? Looks like a prosthetic rodent. Right in the Another pocket. Another specimen. Very nice. Now to rescue some humans and make them escape and make this guy run away. I'm sorry, but no one gets to this clock while I'm here. And unless I have to go chase down some escaped humans, I'm glued to this spot. Rats. That is exactly what we're going to do. Back in the stairway. Back here. This is where the kennel was, right? Yes. Whoa! Dinner for two at Club Tentacle? I can't wait to tell my wife. You weirdo. You're free! Free to do what? Free to... to run wild through the woods like humans should. Big deal. I said you're free. Now get off your fat, lazy butts and start enjoying it. Enjoy being hunted for the rest of our lives by that mustached old tentacle with a big net? If we ran off, he'd be right on our trail. If we stay here, we know we'll be warm and comfortable. Outside, we'd be eating bugs and moss. You'll be eating my fist in a second. The woods are filled with wild animals, lions, tigers, and skunks. Man, I hate skunks. Oh, you hate skunks, huh? I think not. I think not. I think not. That's weird. It's got to find some way of getting that mouse out. There you go. Hey, look! A skunk! Humans, you can't do this. This is an escape proof facility. Who says you can't learn anything from cartoons, eh, kitty? I think not. So he's just. Stay there 
now. Okay. Doors open and now it's closed. We can't get up there, so we gotta find the way to get up there. And that is through the fireplace. Okay. Perfect. Now. And into the window. What for? What for? Nah, not right now. Inside. The rope is probably outside. That's also where a skeleton is, or a mummy, right? Doofus. Alright, come on, come on, come on. I want to get done with this part and then go to sleep. Oh, look at that.
Oh, is it real? Dr. Fred. Switch spots. Oh, gunk. Mm, thought I heard something. Everything okay in there? Well, try and keep it down, okay? Mistake again. <laughs> Oof, Doctor Fred, are you okay? Doctor no. Fred, I'd better get him to the lab. Well, I got him in here, but he's out cold. the whole point of going up there for Coffee 
Bank, yeah, Swiss Bank, Keys, Sparing Inc, Hamster, Funnel, Contract, Contract. I got the contract for you to sign, Doctor. Sorry, I don't like to sign things that I haven't read. Forget it. I'll get rid of Purple Tentacle myself. Oh, yeah? How? I'm starting up a petition to ban all tentacles. Wow! Where do I sign? Right here. What a doofus. <laughs> Well, good luck! Yes, thank you. Dude. What an idiot. Alright. Alright, so... extension cord. Not that it's going to help much. Right. Maybe we should add a rule that you can't dump sludge into the water supply. What manner of fool would do that in the first place? You're right. won't be able to get it very clean without soap. He has soap, right? So, um, hope everybody enjoyed this. We're gonna talk later. It's been fun. I need some sleep. So. It can be yours today. For the special rock bottom introductory price of later. $2 million. The number to call is 1 800 Star Wars. Don't miss this. That's 63 percent done. Awesome. Thanks, guys. Um, don't forget, if you want to check out the podcast, it's just Haunted Log or Roll Die for Adventure or. Um, um, what are the other ones? Uh, Great Plains Ghostbusters Adventure Hour. Um, Haunted Log Old Time Radio Midnight Theater presents, uh, stuff like that. You'll find them all. Alright. Thanks, everybody. Talk to you later.